there I was on my Chromebook in my closet watching ab tutorials watching these clickbaity cliche how to get six packs abs in seven days ab exercises for beginners bullshit like this I was obsessed with getting abs back in the day my 10 year old self was like wanted a good physique wanted to I guess get girls and thought like six pack abs were the way to like everything in life six pack abs everything yeah, it's very um, stereotypical to get six-pack abs. And my my um, younger self would have loved to see this video, would have loved to know what, what it actually took to get abs. So, first off, there's a difference between visual and functional abs. In order for you to get visual abs, you know, we all of us, we all have abs. Everybody has abs. There's only one thing, and there's a layer of fat covering them for everybody. If your abs aren't showing, so you everybody has abs. In order to lose fat, you just need to you know exercise more, eat less. You know the w fat is basically just excess fuel. So if you put take l more out of the tank than you put in, it's gonna have to come out. You're gonna lose fat. So that's the way you get six pack abs. If you of course these ab exercises like doing. Russian twists and all that stuff, it's not going to give you abs if they're not showing already. If your abs are already showing and you want them to be like more bigger, I guess, then the ab exercises will help. But if you're like fat, you know, and you try to do these ab exercises, nothing's gonna happen. You might just feel a burn in your core, but until you actually remove that layer of fat, nothing's gonna show. So that's the harsh truth, of course. That's probably not the answer you wanted to hear, but in order to get abs, that's what it takes. Now let's talk about functional abs, which I'm pretty sure nobody was here for. <laughs> but some sports like wrestling, gymnastics, they require you to have like a good core. I feel like a good core is good for like all physical activity, because when do you not use your core? Running uses your core. Every sport uses your core. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Golf uses it. Batman. Yeah, so the way you get a functional abs is just doing ab exercises, strengthening that core. The worst ab exercise out there is going to be sit-ups. Sit-ups are actually horrible for you. First off, they, like, hurt your spine to do them repeatedly. They're going to, like, put stress on, unnecessary stress on your spine. And they're super outdated. They're old school. Never do sit-ups. They don't even, like, grow your abs that much. So... The way you a good ab exercises are like plank, Russian twists, leg raises, L sit, human flag. Just leave everything but sit ups. I feel like is gonna be a good ab exercise. Um, I want to plug my Discord down below. If you haven't already joined, I've like nobody's in there yet, but it's my only paid product. It's the only thing I'm promoting. So please join, and thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video.